Hi there, and thank you for downloading Smart Receipts. In this video series, we're going to walk you through sort of how to use the app, get acclimated to it, and everything like that. So, starting on the home screen, you'll see kind of a, a basically an empty screen here to start. And in the bottom right, you'll see a plus button. If you hit that, this will be a way of creating your first Smart Receipts expense report. Now, expense reports can be in a variety of things. For instance, they could be a month of the year. For instance, we're uh, in the recording of this video, we're in June 2018. So you could name it June 2018, uh, change your dates accordingly, and make that all line up. Similarly, you could change it to a trip. So if you were a business traveler and you were on a, about to you know, have a consulting project or something like this, this could be a trip to Florida or any other sort of measurement that you use to, to track your receipts in. Um, how this works is every receipt expense report, or every expense report you can think of as a folder where receipts go into a specific folder, and that's where they get saved. So if you see the little check mark or tick mark in the top right corner, we're going to click that to save our expense report, and that will open up a new panel here, which will be our ex a place where we can, inside the expense report, add the receipts. If any time you need to go back and visit what you created before, you can hit the up button in the top left to get the home screen. If you need to edit or change it, you can long press on this item, so tap and hold. Or you can just touch it and return. And so in the next video in the series, we're going to walk you through to how to use within your expense report folder how to actually add new receipts.